So, uh, sorry, I think because we're down, down at the water's edge, signal is a bit tricky, but it seems to be fine now. We are still sitting here very quietly, just watching this hippo in the water. And he really doesn't seem too phased by us at all. Now, again, I wouldn't recommend you do this unless you have a qualified guide with you. Just always remember, you have to be respectful of nature, and you do need to know a bit about animal behavior. If you do bushwalks or walk close to any animals, you always have to be very cautious around water holes. Josh, a hippo can stay underwater for, if it really wanted to, about seven to eight minutes. Um, you know, about seven or eight minutes, but on average it's about two or three minutes that they stay under. So they can hold their breath for quite some time, which is amazing. And they usually do that if they're in big rivers, like, for example, the Zambezi, up between Zimbabwe and Zambia. The Zambezi River is very, very big, very wide, and those hippo move th along those rivers, and there are plenty of hippo there. And if they cross the river, in the deeper sections, they'll hold their breath, run on the bottom of the riverbed to get from one side to the other. So they can stay under, but what they'll do if they need to come up, they'll push themselves up, and they come to the surface, get a breath of air, go down again, and, con and continue running. I'm saying is now I'm thinking uh, I think a hippo gestation period is about 14 months I think nine months I'm trying to think now um, I don't have my mammal book with me and I always get confused with some of these gestation periods um, actually I think a hippo is less it's like nine eight nine eight months nine months somewhere around there 243 days, is that, yeah, there we go, so nine, eight, nine months, somewhere around there, eight months, that's a hippo gestation period.